Oh my god, Noob Noob, I heard they have new casting news for the new Batgirl on CW. Uh, it's, it's HBO Max, actually. No, it's not. Uh, yeah. No, it's, it's gonna be super woke. It's not gonna be in the f- movies. Nope. HBO Max. Subscription-based only. All the woke. Oh, yeah. So let's get right into it. Breaking news. I'm going to get right into her. Oh my god. So this girl I've never heard of from a movie I've never seen will be starring about a bat girl. She, yeah, she'll be Barbara Gordon in HBO Max's exclusive movie, Batgirl. That was, oh, that was the one that, uh, Rapey McGilla ready fuck. Joss Whedon? Yeah, Joss Whedon. Oh, he where he was going to write all the really oh. weird, are they going to use his script? I, oh my God, are they going to use his script ideas? I highly, oh, whatever happened to his HBO show? Uh, I don't know. Still going, but he ain't part of it. Oh, that's right. I forgot about yeah. that. Anyway. What show was that again? The Middles? No. The Nevers? The Nevers. Yeah. Never going to see Joss Whedon again. Mm, Probably. Just like Batgirl on HBO Max is never going to work. Not going to work. Not I don't know. Leslie Grace. Who? I mean, not. I don't think. She's a singer. Batgirl's that popular that people are going to be super excited about this. I mean, especially when we went over the casting of the new Supergirl, and people don't seem to be real thrilled about that either. Not that there's, I don't know, there's anything about this girl. She's 26. Sure. She was in the Heights. She's not that attractive. Oh, get out of town. She's like, okay. But they had, what, first off, is there a picture of what Batgirl looks like in the comics? Oh, I have to find that. Just to give a reference to what they were sure. casting. I will go back, girl. I mean, are you talking about the fact that it's another hmm, Batman girl? <laughs> Batman, yeah, back girl casting. Okay. No, I'm just saying, like, the tight. She's like a young, immature. I mean, sure, she's super white, but that doesn't matter. Oh, wasn't the first Batgirl girl was uh, Alicia Silverstone, right? Yeah, Alicia Silverstone. So what am I looking for here? Oh, just, oh, just like a picture of Barbara uh, Gordon. Okay, back girl. Let's go with back girl images. Look, here's a nice old picture of Batgirl. Yeah. Oh nope. my god, that's the Jesus. Wikipedia version. There yeah, you go, a little that's tiny super picture. Tiny. <laughs> let's, let's, like her tittums. Let's get it even tinier. Like her tittums. Good call. But it's like some nerdy, immature... Yeah, she's supposed to be really young. She's supposed girl. to be a redhead, which yet another redhead falls to Hollywood <laughs> casting. Yeah. I think they're the rarest people on earth. The uh, Gingers? Mm-hmm. Isn't that like a skin defect, honestly, the, with the freckles and stuff? I don't know. I, I think know. they're like 0.01% of the whole population of the oh, world. dear lord. So they took away a special... They could have cast a redhead for this. They and, chose not to. And they chose not to. Correct. Instead, they wanted to choose a singer from a movie that everyone hated. I don't... It didn't do well. That is true. And does... I guess H, does HBO own that movie? Maybe. Uh, came out on HBO Max, so I'm, I'm assuming they have something to do with it. Hmm. Also, well, she definitely doesn't look like... Barbara Gordon. Well, no, uh, Alicia Silverstone from Batman and Robin. That's the only other Batgirl I can think of. Oh, the one on the on the old TV show. Didn't she have her own show with uh, Adam West back in the day? Uh, maybe. I was not alive then, so. <laughs> I don't think anybody was. Yeah. There's not a single human being. Oh, my God. It's going to be else? a new origin story. I don't see. No. Oh, look. These are pictures of, of a redhead. Yeah. And some goth girl. Which yeah. one is which? I don't know. Oh, this is going to be interesting. This She's also handy capable. Gonna wait. What? Oh, because she spoiler. Oh, alert. spoiler. Super spoiler alert. Close your eardrums, people. She gets shotted in the back. Oh, if you watched the Killing Joke, you would have known that. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty. I mean, I think it's, it's common up. knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, she becomes paralyzed and then becomes super. This is all the person. whole comic. Why is this the thing? I don't know. Uh, why? I don't. This is not what I was. Let's looking go for. back to the horrible casting news because there was rumors, and I think they were confirmed, of who was testing for Batgirl. There was like four other girls, and all four of them were better than this. I don't agree with that. There was one that was definitely better than this. You're saying Isabella Merced? Isabella Merced. You're gonna make me look her up? Yes, too? because th- she would have been the perfect Batgirl. Why? Uh, just based off pictures. Just based off of looks and not ever hearing her speak or talk or yeah, act. Just based off of her being just you being shallow. Attractive. 
Oh shit, she played uh, Dora the Explorer. Well, there you go. There's Dora the Explorer. She should have been. That, I now I agree. Oh, yeah. you can't even see her. There you go. Dora the Explorer. Wow, I did not know that. That's wow, 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 fun wow, fact. Wow. There. So they could have cast Dora the Explorer <laughs> as Batgirl. You're making me do things I don't want to oh do. Oh my god, she's an American actress and singer. Why is everyone they're trying to cast a goddamn they're singer? They're all singers. Yeah. These are just lots of pictures of all these girls. Yeah, she is clearly the most attractive. Uh, also, she looks the part because she has the younger, like, immature. <laughs> it's just, what are you talking about? Look. No, you're not like underage. <laughs> Jesus. What are you talking Keep about? I'm just saying she looks. Okay, this oh, picture okay. doesn't. She looks like a hooker there, but still. I don't know that I agree with that, but. Like, sure. that one, she looks fine. Like, she looks like she would play the part well. Uh, you know, I'm just going to go with. Sure, dog. Sure. Like uh, what Leslie Grace looks like, she would Let's have a switchblade in her pocket. What? Yeah. I don't know about like that. Like she hey, would stab me on the way home from there the corner go. street with groceries. Oh my god! Like, what are you talking she about? She reminds me of Why don't you of, go a little bit further? She reminds me of AOC. <laughs> oh no! That's what your real problem yeah. is. There we go. We discovered the root <laughs> of all your problems. It makes you think of AOC when you wanted a more attractive yeah. younger girl. She, oh. uh, uh, she's supposed to be a college student too So for her to be 26 is a little old I mean 26 year olds are co college students The stupid ones <laughs> <laughs> Undergrad If you're in grad school that's like normal age I don't think she's in grad school I don't think so either Yeah But still The studio was already super high on her I'm super low Following on her. her breakout role in the movie that bombed In the Heights This is why Hollywood makes no sense You 100% can fail upwards like, you can be in a movie that bombed and st it won't impact. Like, whoever made Cats, <laughs> all of them need to be fired she from everything. She should have been casting Cats, honestly. She's She should have been the lead butthole in Cats. <laughs> she should have been the she lead. She should have just been cast as the butthole. <laughs> as, like, Taylor as, Swift's butthole? She could have been Taylor Swift's cat butthole. Cat, her kitty cat butthole. Her pussy hole. Wow. Nah, no, that's going too far. Nope. You can edit out her buttholes. Her <laughs> <laughs> meow. Meow, meow. Who, okay, so who, here's who wrote the script, though. Not Joss Whedon. Doesn't appear so. Uh, it's a, it's gonna debut uh, debut exclusively on the streamer. Uh, uh, Adil El Arbi and Bilal Falah uh, will direct the pick. What? <laughs> from a script Are, from Christina Hodson. I feel like we're Kristen Burr is producing. Are we getting invaded by Al Qaeda? What's going on here? <laughs> I know, not quite. Uh, oh my god, you should stop while you're ahead. <laughs> is there any more information we can glean from this? this no, oh, they directed Bad Boys for Life, which you love. It was okay. You love that movie. It was alright. So right. those are the directors that you're making fun what of would for be no even good better, reason. The movie wasn't that great. What would be even <laughs> better if they somehow convinced J.K. Simmons to come back? As our dad? <laughs> <laughs> Just sure, super why Jack not? J.K. Simmons. Yeah, we we don't want regular J.K. Simmons. We want super the Tomorrow War J.K. Simmons. Jack J.K. Simmons. Yes, where he thought he was in another movie, and clearly no one told him that he was only a small part of a much larger movie. Yeah, because <laughs> he got so jacked. Oh, look at that! Uh, Isabel um, Merced was also in Sicario: Day of Soldano, or Soldado. Yeah. Soldado. Sure. Zoe Dutch was in Zombieland Double Tap. And support the I didn't girl. see that either. I've, been some, I've seen none of these movies, but I, I'm assuming all these actresses are amazing. I assume. Zoe Deutsch is not that great. I'm going to go just with. Hire Dora the Explorer. Let's go with Dora the Explorer. Yeah. So our vote was for Dora the Explorer, which I did not know before we filmed this. I did not either. But for everyone else out there. This is great news. Yeah. This is so great. The best. This is the best news ever. Just take our word for it. This is going to be a good one, folks. You're going to be like, this is a movie that just transcends time and space. Forever. Uh, exactly. Number one. Joss Whedon is going to cast and catch her so hard. Oh my god, he probably already did. He's going to never her. Anyway, uh, make sure you catch our live podcast. Uh, we broad stream it. No, we cross live the stream streams. It. We, we cross the streams, 7.30 mm -hmm. p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, for more news, reviews, rants, and unintelligible banter, please like and subscribe. Take that thumb. 
Dude. Put it right into Leslie Grace's poop shoot. No. For every subscribe, I will get these little fingers extra stinky. Oh my god. <laughs> so anyway, uh, it looks like we're definitely <laughs> on to the next one.